Hey, Posse. Now this bombshell bikini barista has TikTok percolating with a whole bunch of piping hot Java about the many freak nasty requests that she regularly receives from a whole bunch of ex, ex, extra thirsty clients at the roadside coffee shop that she works out of in Washington State. As you guys know, I'm a bikini barista, so I work in my lingerie bay and I make coffee, etc. And something that nobody ever talks about is the fact that these customers somewhat fall in love with you. Before I get to spilling tea on this lusty lingerie wearing coffee brewer, I need you to pop, lock, and drop a like to this video and subscribe to this page. So let's get into it. So this young lady, her name is Grace Morris. She's 20, she's blonde, she's cute, she's hot. She does some OnlyFans modeling on the side. Her daily uniform consists of lingerie, corsets, bikinis, thongs, G-strings, you name it. Obviously, she's gonna have a lot of very thirsty men, not just thirsty for coffee, but thirsty for other things. I recently met a customer and in one day of knowing him, he brought me this. Oh yeah, no, no, no. A mug that says you're my favorite. Because I'm his favorite. And um, hot sauce. One of the videos that stood out to me most was a clip where she talks about some of the guys who order coffee asking her to drink from the cup before she serves it to them. And at first she was a little offended. She was a little pissed off. Like, what do you mean drink from the cup? Do you think I peed in it? And then she goes, wait a minute. No, I get it now. They just want my mouth on their coffee cup, which I was like, ugh, not because of her, but just because it's COVID. Because even if it's not COVID, that's germs. That's somebody else's saliva. I mean, these men are paying her for the coffee and then they're giving her tips for these kind of cool, sexy moments she may or may not get them. Now, while she happily will drink out of a person's coffee cup before they receive it, she definitely draws the line when it comes to the more inappropriate, nasty, depraved requests that these guys come up with. You know, this old man comes through missing like half of his teeth as they usually do. And he goes on to tell me, he goes, let me take your sweet, tight, young looking ass of yours out on a date. You know, I'm busy. Weirdos and creeps beware of me because I kickbox, I know karate, I know how to call up the homies if it gets too crazy. I definitely admire how Grace is just so hard lined when it comes to stuff that she's not cool with. If there is a coffee shop that needs a barista in the area, let me know because I'm totally with it. I think that it is a very empowering position to have. As the person who's coming into the job, you're taking control of your beauty, your sexuality. I just respect it. I love being a journalist and a reporter. I wouldn't trade that for the world. But when I see other girls exploring their talents and using their bodies and brains and beauties in ways that aren't on camera or that aren't writing articles or, or journals for, or you name it, I really respect it. I think that she's doing a great thing. And you know, like Hooters girls, like exotic dancers, you know, everybody's out here making a coin as long as she's not hurting herself or others. I can't knock it.